Absolutely, the specifics about the high-performance version of the Cybertruck were clearly presented during the Spaces call on the X platform by Yaman Tastavar, someone who had experience driving the Cybertruck with the same motor as the Model X Plaid on October 3rd. He elaborated on the significant changes in this version of the Cybertruck, ranging from its external appearance to the technical specifications of its motor. Additionally, it was revealed that the vehicle features a battery system that operates at an impressive voltage, reaching up to 800 volts, based on information shared by Tesla staff members. But first, please give us a like, share, and a subscription so we can reach 1,000 subscribers. Thank you very much. Without further ado, let's get started. What modifications are present in the performance version of the new Cybertruck? The latest iteration of the Tesla Cybertruck has been the subject of significant attention and speculation, with several key modifications and features that set it apart from its earlier versions. While the fundamental design of the Cybertruck remains largely unchanged, several notable updates have been introduced to enhance its performance, practicality, and convenience. One of the most discussed changes in the new Cybertruck is the glass. The initial presentation featured what was purported to be bulletproof glass, but it famously cracked during a public test with Franz and Elon Musk. In the performance version, Tesla has opted for double-layer soundproof glass to reduce cabin noise. This decision not only addresses the issue of noise but also helps keep the vehicle's cost in check. Parking in confined spaces has been made more manageable with the implementation of a front bumper camera system. This system optimizes the display screen to provide better visuals during off-road maneuvers and tight parking situations. It effectively minimizes the risk of blind spot collisions and obstructions during parking. However, it's worth noting that the performance model of the Cybertruck does not include an integrated rear door ramp, a feature that was initially anticipated. The rationale behind this omission is the substantial increase in weight that a tailgate ramp would introduce, estimated at around 300 pounds, which could negatively impact the vehicle's overall performance. Customers can still request the installation of this feature but at an additional cost. On a more positive note, the new Cybertruck iteration incorporates a standard spare wheel beneath the bed, following the design approach of the Rivian R1T. This not only adds to the vehicle's visual appeal but also ensures practicality in case of a flat tire. One of the standout features is the Cybertruck's reportedly incredibly short turning radius. This characteristic could be a game-changer, especially when navigating tight spaces or tackling challenging off-road terrain. The performance model offers multiple traction modes tailored to various scenarios, providing drivers with flexibility in choosing the most suitable mode for their needs. An unprecedented feature, as disclosed by the renowned source Matthew Donegan Ryan, is the potential introduction of two-way charging functionality in the forthcoming Cybertruck. Furthermore, the truck bed will feature three power outlets providing both 240 and 120 volts of electrical power, which could be a game-changer for outdoor and off-grid enthusiasts. In a departure from convention, the new Cybertruck lacks air ducts for the HVAC port system in the bed. However, the rear glass in the center gate can be opened, allowing for the possibility of camping in an air-conditioned environment within the truck bed. Tesla has added a range of convenience-enhancing features to the latest Cybertruck. Notably, the tonneau cover can be operated through the Tesla app or the main control unit, enhancing cargo carrying capacity. It's essential to note that while the rear door has an automatic opening mechanism, it does not feature automatic closing for safety reasons. The interior of the performance model offers enhanced seating comfort and floor mats similar to those in other Tesla models, departing from the rubber mats commonly found in other off-road vehicles. Despite these subtle refinements, the Cybertruck retains traditional design elements of a modern pickup truck. These modifications and features aim to meet the demanding requirements of high performance while providing practical and functional updates for future owners. In what ways will the performance of the Cybertruck differ from that of the dual-motor version? Tesla seems to be adopting a cautious approach, likely in anticipation of the final steps in the EPA certification process. As a result, the company has refrained from hastily revealing detailed delivery plans, even though the Cybertruck delivery event is scheduled for late October. In the initial wave of deliveries, Tesla intends to introduce two official versions. The dual-motor variant will be the high-volume edition, while the high-performance version, which is currently under discussion, may be available in limited quantities. 
The pricing of these upcoming versions remains a significant concern. On the launch day in 2019, Elon Musk disclosed the expected prices for various motor variants. However, since then, there has been a wealth of information indicating potential price fluctuations. In reality, the cost of this new performance version is expected to exceed that of the dual motor variant. It is projected to be priced at around $79,000, in contrast to the dual motor version's price point of approximately $69,000. The pricing difference can be attributed to the incorporation of a new and advanced motor, deviating from the initial launch specifications. As revealed, the upcoming Cybertruck version will integrate the Model X Plaid motor, promising a significant performance boost compared to the dual motor variant. This enhancement results in an extended driving range of up to 500 miles, compared to the standard dual motor model's 300-mile range. Achieving this increased range also depends, to some extent, on the battery pack size. While the dual motor version utilizes the 4680 type battery pack with a capacity of 127 kilowatts, the Plaid motor equipped Cybertruck could potentially employ one with a capacity of 232 kilowatts. In line with the prevailing trend in electric vehicle design, which favors minimalistic aesthetics and reduced bulk, the new Cybertruck will feature fewer accessories compared to the dual motor version. This strategic simplification not only contributes to a lighter vehicle weight but is especially significant for a performance-oriented model. Although the impact may not be dramatic, the reduction in components enhances the towing capability of the new Cybertruck, surpassing that of its dual motor counterparts. It is expected that the Cybertruck equipped with the Plaid motor will boast a towing capacity of 15,000 pounds, exceeding the anticipated 10,000 pound capacity of the dual motor variant. However, the production of the new version presents certain challenges due to its reliance on an 800 volt system. This requires compatible accessories and charging ports operating at the same power level, a capability that Tesla currently lacks. As a result, the production of the new version is expected to be more intricate and limited in scale compared to the dual motor variant. What are your thoughts on the enhancements made to the Cybertruck? Do you believe these changes will offer an exceptional driving experience across various vehicle categories? Feel free to share your viewpoints in the comments section below. If you found this information interesting, please express your support by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribing if you haven't already, and turning on notifications to stay informed about the latest content from Techstars. Your viewership is greatly valued, and we eagerly await your return for upcoming updates. In the meantime, stay well and stay safe.